okay so today we are going to start with two digit divided by one digit division okay okay so I'll just write it division okay so now i'll two digit divide by one digit it is very easy as there are only few number of digits okay as in every formula in every thing of multiplication and division as we do we find out first ki kitne number mein answer aega and how many digits our answer will come so that we know in the end if our answer is correct or not okay suppose if our answer is supposed to be in two digits but our answer comes in three digits so we'll know that this answer is wrong and we are supposed to get it in two digits only so we can rectify our mistake here but what if we don't know ki answer in how many digits our answer should come we'll not know so if i my answer will come in three digits but it was supposed to then i'll think that this three digit answer is correct obviously because i would not know in how many digits i have my answer actually, hmm actually voice is breaking uh now hmm. okay so now let's start with the original steps now in two digits divided by one digit how many digits are there here two here one so two minus one is one one the answer should come in one digit okay okay but there are also some cases there are answer comes in two digit instead of this so what we can consider in division it is not that important to know the number of digits but still we can get an idea that it should come near one so it can be either one or two but not less than one okay or not three okay. digits because that will be too big okay, okay. now let's do question 69 divided by three okay now how will we do this this is the method that is used in our normal schools also in the normal mathematics because see you'll write it in this form the fraction form and what we usually do we do some kind of this like this okay my answer is 23 i'll tell you how i got it but this is how we do in our normal schools also. So this will be helpful in your higher classes when you when your teacher is teaching you that how to do division fast. Okay. Because we always write it in the fraction form of any division that we have. Suppose we have yeah. uh, 7, 2, 4, 9 divided by 8. So we will write it in the fraction form and we'll solve it also in the fraction form. Because that is how we do in normal mathematics as well. Because it is easier. Okay. So mainly in this method, the school method, what we do is we'll see ki on which table are 69 also comes and 3 also comes. So in 3 is table it comes, then we'll divide it and we'll get the answer. If the denominator is not 1, then we'll divide it further further till we get the denominator as 1. Okay, that is how we do it. Yeah. But now tell you the abacus method that we have. So now basically when we do the divisions in backers, it is very long. Okay. So many institutes teachers teach only the mental part and I'm only, only teaching the mental part because in a backers, why it is long because you have to set the rods and all and that is very hectic. Okay. So know the mental formula. Now how do we do it? 69 divided by 3. So our first step would be to divide the first digit of our first number to the second digit that is three what are you saying we were, we were simplifying the number that is not what we'll do what we will do now in the backers in a backers the formula is different in your school it is different but it's just similar okay yeah. now six divided by three is how much two we'll write two here then 9 divided by 3 is how much? 3. 
और कोई रिमेन हम भी रोना भी नहीं रिमेंडर बिकॉज द बोथ द रम वॉज वो आर डिविजिबल बाई थ्री प्रॉपरली राइट सो सो आर आंसर इज ट्वेंटी थ्री दिस इज दिस वॉज अ डायरेक्ट डिविजन ओके Now we'll take one more question that would be not direct, but we'll get a remainder there, and then I'll take you in points as well. So let's take a number. In my copy, you have made you have made sixty five divided by two. Ah, we'll take a different example today so that you know. डिफरेंट डिफरेंट काइंड हाउ विल डू इट ओके और यू गेट कंफ्यूज कि हम मैम ने एक क्वेश्चन करवाया दूसरा क्वेश्चन मुझे समझ में नहीं आ रहा ठीक है लेट्स डू अनदर वन एट टी नाइन डिवाइडेड बाय टू एटी नाइन डिवाइडेड बाय टू नाउ आर आंसर शुड कम इन वन और टू डिजिट सच वी नो ओके नाउ व्हाट वर द फर्स्ट टू डू आर द फोर डिजिट बाय द वर्स फर्स्ट डिजिट सो एट डिवाइडेड बाय टू इज फोर Now second digit nine divided by two is now nine does not come in two table. We'll take a smaller number than that. That is eight. eight. That comes in table to four of eight divided by two is four. Okay. Eight. Now nine minus eight is how much? One. So we'll put a point here, and we'll add a zero to this one that we have left from this subtraction. Yes, so four. ten divided by two is how much? Five. Hmm? Five. Correct. Forty-four point five is our answer. What uh, uh, else? What we can do is here that we can just leave it in the remainder form instead of bringing it in the the points. So when I did nine minus eight, I got one. So what can okay. I do? I'll just write forty-four. A little slant here that we write it in a marker so that we know what is the remainder. A little slant, and we'll write a small one here so that we know that forty four is our quotient with one because eighty nine was not fully divisible by two. Only a part of it was divisible by two. That that was eighty eight, and then one we got as our remainder. Okay. Okay. Now let's take one more example. Ninety eight divided by two. If we are left hmm. with the remainder, we add the decimal point, right? Say it again. If we have a remainder, we add a decimal point. Yes, but not every time. Uh, forty-four divide uh point one aya. ठीक है इसके आगे मतलब five आया था हमारा. इसके आगे ये नहीं है कि हमें एक और अगर रिमाइंडर इसके बाद भी बचा तो एक एक और पॉइंट आ जाएगा नहीं वो पॉइंट के आगे कंटिन्यू होता रहेगा ठीक है रिमाइंडर एज टू नावल एड इट योर एज यू नो Twenty eight is divided by seven. Yes, it is divisible by seven. So we'll get the answer as four. So fourteen is our answer. Okay. Let's take one more. Eighty eight divided by seven. Now this is not com completely divisible. This was completely divisible by, but now this is not okay. Eight divided by seven is one. We get a remainder as one. We add it here, eighteen. Now eighteen we don't get it on seven table. What do we get? We get fourteen. So that is on two. We'll add a point here. Eighteen minus fourteen is four. We'll add a zero here. Forty doesn't come. Thirty-five comes on five. We got thirty-five. Okay. So now we'll just minus this from forty. How much do we get? Five. We'll add a zero here. Fifty. Now fifty comes on seven table. No, forty nine comes on seven. And here we'll just minus it. We get our remainder as one. We add a zero to it, and then we continue the cycle. But now I'm not continuing the cycle because uh, normally when you do any uh sum, sorry division, you only have to write two points. If you want to do it further, I can do it further. Ten. Seven comes in seven tables. So one we'll write here. 
थ्री विल बी द रिमाइंडर थर्टी फोर एंड दिस लाइक द साइकिल विल कंटिन्यू ओके बट ओनली टू डिसमल पॉइंट्स आर नीडेड वेन एवर यू डू द For the points are not needed, so you can just erase it. So twelve point five seven is our answer. We could just write twelve slash five. Yes, we can also write it like that. Twelve slash five. This is also correct. It was your choice. Okay. Okay. But you understood the point thing, na? Decimal. Hmm. Uh, yes. Okay. In our final term, we have decimal. Yes, that is why I'm teaching you so our uh, division becomes easy. So whenever suppose you get a question like twenty five divided by two, so you can easily do that. One two point five, twelve point five. You easily got that. You got your answer. So one, two, decimal. Me one tha. Our was one. Zero. Pe zero. Add kara. Ten one gaya. Ten divided by two. Five hota. Five. Aap me likh diya. Twelve point five. Our answer hai. ठीक है? Okay. Any other? Uh, कोई किसी example में doubt हो कि two digit divided by one में? No. Okay. Very nice. That was all. This is a very easy concept. If you learn this concept, you will know three digit also, you will know four digit also, and so on. Like five digit, six digit, all of you will you will know. Okay, because same formula was digits are done. Okay.